My early childhood was truly very challenging, very difficult. Uh, I was born into utter poverty in Mao's Communist China. I was born in the year 1961. I was the sixth of seven peasant sons. And as a child, I had big dreams. And then suddenly one day, the delegates from the Beijing Dance Academy came to select talents to study ballet when I was 10, just about turning 11. That one moment changed my entire fate. And then just turning 11, I went to Beijing to study ballet. So my life then changed forever. The reason I love ballet was truly that ballet is one of the most beautiful art forms. And ballet is an art form that can really inspire people, can move people, can make people reflect or realize what is precious in life. I met my wife Mary when I was dancing in London. She was a beautiful ballerina and then she became my dance partner subsequently. And she was the reason I was first invited to dance in an interna international gala in Sydney uh, with Australian Ballet. And uh, the, my first impression of this country was it is absolutely beautiful. It's a beautiful country. People were warm, so is the weather. I've traveled around the world to many countries, many cultures. I love Australia. I think Australian people are wonderful and generous in spirit. I became an Australian citizen in 2000. And uh, I was, it's, the more I lived here uh, since I moved here, and the more I really realized this is the country I love. This is the country I'm proud to call home. And this is a country I'm willing to give my utmost all to contribute to the betterment of uh, all people and uh, of the international standing. Feel like you, you know, not even feel like belong, but really, I guess, truly belong and to be feel truly accepted. I, I think becoming a citizen is something you, you do, you've got to do it. Yeah.